fun things planned for you. It's true. Hi! <laughs> JK, it's Eden. They know it's me because I've been on the channel about 15 We're clearly, minutes. clearly you're not me, but... <clears throat> hi everyone! You can... T hi, I'm driving so I'm gonna focus on driving, but you know, you can yes, that's good. look at Eden, hear me, or you know, whatever. But today is going to be very exciting because I am going to go do something very <laughs> drastic to my hair. Um, it's not drastic, it's gonna be so good. Yeah, it's gonna be good. I am absolutely sick of my straight, boring, annoying hair. So I'm gonna go get a perm. <laughs> hey! And people have given me their opinions, and you know what? Your opinion is valid, but it actually isn't because it's my hair and I get to decide what I wanna do. But it do. actually isn't. <laughs> so just kidding. <laughs> well, not when it's, a, everyone's opinion is valid unless it's talking about someone else's body. So you know what, there you mm -hmm. go. Anyway, so today we're heading to a certain salon. Ulta, you can tell. It Ulta, me. okay, I didn't know. Yeah, that's okay, where so I get my hair colored and, uh, and everything. So today we're heading to Ulta Salon. This is where Emma gets all of her hair stuff done. And we're, I'm gonna watch, and I'm excited to watch because this is, I've never watched somebody get their hair perfect. Um but Emma's gonna get it done to her hair. Yeah, and it's not like this is like a spur of the moment kind of thing. This no. is something I've wanted to do with my hair, and I've been so bored of my hair for like a month now, mm -hmm. and I've wanted to do something different, and I've always liked curly hair, and I've always considered a perm, but I've never actually done it. Yeah. And last Tuesday, I went into Ulta, and I talked to my stylist, her name's Jennifer. So Jennifer Thanks, and I Jennifer. talked. Thanks, Jennifer. We talked for a while, and um, I asked her about the care of uh, getting a perm, and like how damaging it is to your hair, what do I do if I don't like it? Um, you know, different things like that. So I really have put a lot of thought into this, and it's not just like something I'm gonna go do on a Sunday morning, but yeah, it's like, I'm really excited about it, and I think that it'll turn out good, and there are multiple reasons why I wanted to do this, and actually the other day on my way to go talk to Jennifer, I vlogged a little clip, and I'm not sure what kind of mood I was in, because it sounded <laughs> really stupid, but I'm gonna insert parts of that clip right now so that you can see just what was going through my brain when I was thinking about this, so there you go. This is a video for me in the future, this is my hair, and it's straight and boring. And my favorite part about the possibility of getting perm is that I'll never have to deal with that boy ever again until my hair goes straight again. But I just thought I would document that to give you reason number 412 why this is a good idea. See, look, I even tried to fix it and it went back to it. See, there's no fixing it. It's just gross, it gets greasy all the time and it's disgusting. And let me just tell you that I would feel so much more free like, I look fine in this video, mm -hmm. but <laughs> it's a bit crowded on the Classic highway that we're about to get in. But it's, it's, it's just boring. I'm just so, like, if you have straight hair, I'm not hating on you or anything. I just, I have had the same hairdo for my whole life. See, this is driving me crazy for my whole life, except for that time I got it, or two times that I got it dyed, and I loved it because it was like a rejuvenation. But I'm just sick of this. It's dying at the ends, and so I mean to get it trimmed anyway, but I know that you have to get it permed and then cut, I know. But, um, so I know this is probably gonna be, I know it is gonna be damaging to my hair, but that's fine because now I'm gonna probably put more uh, value in my hair and in, uh, getting good soap that will keep it strong and everything. Also, my hair's gotten thicker, so I have the hope that it's going to be thick enough and make this look good. Also, think about how much less work it's gonna be for my hair, because I'm going to be able to just wake up, I can take a shower at night, or I can take a shower in the morning, because it won't get as greasy. What do you think about that? And uh, it's just gonna be there, and I can throw it this way, or that way but it's gonna be cute okay anyway so if you're looking for a delicious festive new Starbucks drink some of you have probably tried this if you have leave a comment below <laughs> anyway this is a chai tea latte with yeah. gingerbread syrup now if you don't like as Emma said spicy stuff don't get it but honestly it's not as spicy as it is sweet so I yeah, think this one's more mild. I got one the other day. It was like so many spices. So many ones. spices. Yeah, from the chai and also from the. So chicken. it depends on which Starbucks you go to. Obviously, I guess that's you know everyone makes it differently. But not only will you get a cute and adorable cup, but this is 
delicious. You should it's just delicious. work for Starbucks. Me? Yeah. You're, so, you're good at promoting. I'm good at promoting yeah. things? What if I'm just a advertisement person? An advertisement mm. person. Oh, yes, you should. Should I tell you? Uh, uh, yes. Are you going to... I thought it's in Knoxville. It is. It's just both places in Knoxville. I'm going... Anyway. <laughs> Anywho. Um, what I was... I was gonna say this, I just introduced Eden to this drink, like right now, um, but I've been drinking it for like three years now, all around the festive season, so shout out, shout out to Tucker, my good friend, who actually introduced this to me, he's now even out of the country, he's, he's a Ireland. world traveler, love that boy, just he's thought I would do a little shout out. Yeah. Back for Thanksgiving. Oh, is he? I actually didn't know that. Yeah, he's I'm an island, he's coming back, is he go? Is he leaving again after Thanksgiving? Yeah, he's going to India, I think. Anyway, goals, being Tucker, the world traveler, and, you know, being ahead of the trends. There you go. There you it, go. He has actually a travel blog. He has a blog, yeah. Yes, so go subscribe to that. It's called Six Foot Travels, I think. Something like that. He's really tall. tall. Travels. Yeah, anyway. Excuse I'll, me, link, sir. Link down below. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yes, so. like uh, chicken soup and, and chemicals. I think it smells like someone's burning chicken soup. It's not bad. It's not the best. It's yeah, it's good. I'm excited. Super cute. I can't, I keep getting my thumb stuck, so it just does that. Yeah, that's okay. Oh well. Oh well. <laughs> How are you feeling? Good. You feeling nice? I'm uncomfortable a little bit. What? So this, we just, we, I didn't do anything. I just sat here. <laughs> but just rinsed. Your hair looks really nice and shiny, oddly enough. That's good. Um, it actually looks black in the camera. Yeah. So yes. Is this now, white or black? The bowl is white. So now Emma's going to sit here for five minutes to let her curls, her beautiful curls set. And, oh, yep. <laughs> and then we're going to rinse one more time, put some conditioner stuff in it, and then we'll be done. So I'll get the conditioner and other stuff too. Don't you worry, kids. Don't you worry for a second. So for your hair? Yeah. Yes, I'm really excited. I think it's gonna look good too. So I just wanna say that this is not a disclaimer, but I don't, after everyone watches this video, I just want them to know that do not go into a hairstyling place anymore without asking questions first and learning about hairstyle. Because after today, I realized that there's 
so much stuff behind you. And you're like, okay, I'm gonna put you in the video so that you can see. I'm sure I look weird, but that's okay. No, you look if you're sitting there. There's so much stuff involved with like hairstyling and that kind of feel that nobody knows about. And so hair stylists get a bad rap when that's not fair because they work really hard and there's a lot of stuff that goes into it. So just so you know, just so you know, just so you're aware. <laughs> Yeah. So exactly. Explaining. Go ahead. Yes. Oh my gosh. She cute. She cute. Put that in the intro. She cute. She cute. Like I look crazy. Kind of look like someone from the fifties. This is like. I'm the exact embodiment of uh, Marty Maraschino from Greece, currently. My character that I played last year in the musical. Watch. There's, watch. There's a vlog on Hannah Ashton's, Ashton's channel. Ashton. Link down below. Actually, not at all, but we should probably go eat after this. I'm so hungry right now. What do you want? I don't know, but I'm hungry. We shall think about it. Just got the neutralizer things. Thank you. In. Mm. Oh, wait, wait. Put that in the intro. It looks really cute with your ring. Just so you're aware. <laughs> Anyways, so got the neutralizer in. Mm -hmm. it smells a lot better than burnt chicken noodle soup. Yeah, it smells like, um, it's like soapy. I'm like, Nessie, you can go get your oil and a filter and do it yourself for way less than yes. what you charge with. Like, and they're gonna look really loose because we're here still. All right, lean back in one more time. I'm gonna rinse. Okay. Wow. Much better. Yeah, exactly. yeah. It's also the kid who was wearing heels. Surprise! It's not a surprise, but you knew what it was gonna happen. <laughs> Look how girly! I love it! And it's really cute, and I can just be like, Hey, it's me. I don't know what that is, but it's gonna be so much fun. Oh my gosh, my battery's about to die. That's so annoying. But hi, I hope that you like it. I think it's really cute, and it's also the curls are tighter than they're actually going to be regularly um, because I have to give it a couple days, um, and it'll fall out a little bit. But that'll be good. And it's also still mildly wet right now, so it doesn't have a lot of volume. The way that she dried it too, she dried it like uh, more under, and then when I do it, I'm gonna do it like up. That's what she told me to do if I want more volume, which I do. And then I got a diffuser, and I got for my hair and special creams like some frizz stuff like to help the curls be curls and not poofy this mess is the um, redken curvaceous 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 there you I go can read. she can read oh look at that i'm like i don't know i just i feel like this is more me for now it's good and i like it we're gonna go eat food now yes okay delicious. see you in a minute we came to Panera. We got salad. So cute. What did I just do? I feel like a whoa. Majestic lion. So it's cute. I'm sorry, I just smacked you with my camera. This is so exciting. I like it. It looks really good because I don't even feel like I'm like having it looks like so natural. It's like it's always yeah. been that way. I'm starting to dry a little bit more. I can also like you know put it where I want to. Hi, we're in my room now. Like my beautiful friend cleaning my room for me. <laughs> I didn't even ask her to. Cause I'm about to edit this video because it's Sunday and that means I should already have this uploaded, but I didn't. <laughs> so I have to work on that and she offered to do that because my room's a wreck and she's wonderful. See, so it's like, oh, don't even look. And uh, 
yeah, so I hope we like my hair. I like it. It's gonna do better in a couple days. Not be so, you know, greasy or anything. And it's gonna be bigger and it's gonna be great. So it's cute, it's good. Okay, I hope you liked this video, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below if you're not, and I will see you next Sunday at 8 o'clock. Bye!